What is up, Drum Alert Nation? I'm your host, Killer Keemstar. Let's get right into the news. Now, our first story is about YouTube drama. Surprise, surprise. Apparently, YouTube has a big problem, and it's YouTube drama. A video was uploaded yesterday from PewDiePie titled YouTube Drama, where he goes on to explain that YouTube has a big problem, drama, that some channels are even based on covering drama. I wonder who the hell he's talking about. He goes on to say that every YouTuber is putting in their two cents on drama to get 20 cents back, making the point that YouTubers are making videos about drama for views and money. Well, today, KSI, yeah, KSI, believe it or not, fired back. KSI uploaded a video titled, Talking About YouTube Changing to Get Views. In the video, KSI says that PewDiePie is basically a hypocrite because he literally made a video about YouTube drama with ads on it, making money. KSI also said he thought it was weak that PewDiePie talked about channels surrounding drama instead of just calling out Dramalert and all these other YouTubers. Also in the video, KSI stated that YouTube does not have a problem at all. YouTube is fine and great just the way it is. Then PewDiePie responded to KSI's video on Twitter by saying this, going to KSI for advice how to act online is about as useful as asking Toby Turner for relationship advice. So what do I think about all this? I think PewDiePie is fucking hypocritical. He literally, in this tweet today, is talking about KSI and Toby Turner. And not just to mention that, but a few months ago, PewDiePie uploaded a video titled, It's Just a Prank Bro. Now in this song slash video, PewDiePie takes digs at Nicole Arbor, Roman Atwood, FouseyTube, Basher, you name it. So many YouTubers he calls out in this. Isn't this like, basically involving yourself in drama for views and money. I just feel the need to not just defend drama alert, but to defend other YouTubers that make videos on subjects based on drama. I hate everything, Philip DeFranco, Grade A Under A, H3H3, even Boogie2988, and the thousands of other YouTubers that make videos on trending topics or drama topics that are relevant in the YouTube space. I feel like PewDiePie didn't just take a dig at me and just didn't take a dig at these YouTubers, but also took a dig at all of our fans for enjoying this type of content. I find it insulting and hypocritical. Cause like I said, PewDiePie has made videos about drama in the past. He's made tweets talking about drama, but at the end of the day, Maybe it's just a prank, bro. Ladies and gentlemen, that's it for the news today. Guys, if you enjoy Drama Alert, make sure you slap a like on it. Drama Alert Nation, now over 1,402,000 subscribers. Hashtag shove your bro fist up your ass.